Justin with JMAC Customs here on the range today to test our prototype muzzle brakes against the Lantac Dragon. Our friend Nate Cochran was uh, gracious enough to let us borrow this to test today. Thanks, Nate. The reason we're testing this muzzle brake on an SBR is because the SBR doesn't burn all the powder so it's got a lot of energy that's released at the end of the barrel so we can have a better grasp at how well the muzzle brake really works. This is without a muzzle brake whatsoever. This is just the open threaded barrel here. This is the three slot JMAC prototype. We'll see how it does. Four port JMAC Customs muzzle brake. This brake is the Lantac Dracon Dragon. We're going to test it out. Since most of you at home are probably thinking 762 by 39 really isn't much recoil, now we're going to do the testing on a PSL 762 by 54R. Doing the PSL now without a muzzle brake. Try it first. Mac 3 port on the PSL. Gonna do the JMAC 4 port on the PSL this time. Three rounds.
Got the land tech break on it this time. Ready? So after reviewing some of the footage, we realized that the Lantec does have a little more force down on the barrel. And you can see in the PSL video that it actually causes the barrel to bend and, and warp a little bit uh, from the down pressure. Uh, as far as felt recoil goes, the Fourport and the Lantac, they, they feel very similar and uh, actually very proud of the prototype that we made. Hopefully this will be on the market soon, guys. Stay tuned.